There's the lineup. Shanti Augustine of Grenada, Sophia Swindell, U.S. Virgin Islands, Abiba Harris, Jamaica, Saran Abati, Martinique, Nia Richards, Bahamas, Bianca, Brianna Campbell, sorry, of Jamaica, Gianna Paul, don't expect her to be there, Trinidad and Tobago. Swindell, first year competing at the under-20 level. Harris could threaten that record. Abiba Harris has already run 12.95. Seven Jamaican junior athletes have been under 13 seconds in the 100 hurdles. She is number six on that list with her personal best 1295 done at the Carifta trials. But listen to this. She's never won a Carifta medal and she's never won a champs medal in the sprint hurdles. Her one champs medal came over 200 meters a couple of years ago. This is a massive moment for Habiba Harris. She's shown so much potential, but hasn't quite been able to deliver on the big stage. Is this the moment she changes all of that? Brianna Campbell, the second Jamaican, has been very fast this season as well. Beaten by Harris at the trials, 13-1-4, her fastest time. Fall started at the high school championship, so that was a massive disappointment for her. Habiba Harris was also disappointing at the high school championships. She got it all wrong in the final. And so both of them looking for redemption in this race. The under 20 girls, 100 meter hurdles. Pretty good field. Augustine from Grenada will go in lane two. Swindell from the US uh, Virgin Islands will be one to watch out for. Does he a slapping her hip numbers? And of course, Richards from the Bahamas. There is Augustine of Grenada. 14.80 personal best to win the Republic Bank Intercall Championships here in Grenada. She will start in lane number two and will have the home crowd behind her. As the athletes stand behind their blocks getting ready to be introduced again to the crowd here i think we have the biggest crowd that we've had for the carifta game so far already and it's expected to get bigger throughout the course of the afternoon heading into evening there's the lineup augustine swindle harris abati richards campbell no paul on the outside in lane number eight And this crowd, a number of them, as Gerard said earlier, have remained through the break. Lengthy break. A number of them have stayed and waited for the evening session. Sophia Swindell of the U.S. Virgin Islands will fancy her shot at a medal here. Sixth in the Pan American on the 20 final last summer. She has gone 14-0-1. There is Swindell. She goes in lane number three. Focused on the task at hand. Great opportunity for her. The 17-year-old Bohemian Nia Richards in lane number six. 14-22 personal best. Ran that in qualifying at the Bohemian trials. There is Brianna Campbell, the second fastest in the field from Jamaica. 13-1-4. On your mark. Redemption on her mind after the disappointment of the Jamaican High School Championships. Champs for short. Final of the under 20 girls, 100 hurdles. 13.06 is the record. Could be under threat here. Clean break. Abiba Harris got up well. The Grenadian clips the first hurdle. Harris is into her running. Chased by her teammate, Brianna Campbell. Habiba Harris is going away. Habiba Harris is finally a champion. She wins the Honor 20 Girls 100 hurdles. It's been a long time in coming. She's shown so much quality over the years, but has been unable to put it together on the biggest stage. She does it right now, and she does it in the most emphatic fashion. She does it, in fact, in record fashion. 12.93. The time 
that's coming up there on the display board. Two one hundredths of a second faster than the 12.95 she delivered at the trials. She goes sub 13 again for a second time. Brianna Campbell with a personal best as well. Assuming all of this is win legal, by the way, 13.11 for Campbell to take the silver. The Jamaicans get 1-2. And I told you, Swindell had a great shot at a medal. 13.95. The U.S. Virgin Islands athlete captures the bronze. Michelle Smith won a silver medal in this event at the under-17 level two years ago. And now the USVI have another medalist. Here's another look at it. Just great execution there, moving between those hurdles, and uh, she just pulls away. Both Jamaicans really pulling away from the competition, but uh, certainly Harris having the better of the two. Clean, crisp, wind 2.4. 2.4 meters per second, the wind speed we're hearing, so that would mean that it is not a record if it is not win legal. But Habiba Harris has put a fabulous race together, and you can see there the wind pushing the athletes forward, which is exactly what it would have been doing during the race. As the world champion of 2009, Bridget Foster Hilton, will tell you, doesn't always help the athletes in the hurdles when you have all that wind behind you because it means that you get to the barriers too quickly and it's not always easy to negotiate. So positive 2.4 meters per second, the wind speed. Harris 12.93, she is the champion, won't get the record because it's over the legal limit of 2.0. Brianna Campbell gets silver at 13.11 and Sophia Swindell of the US Virgin Islands takes bronze at 13.95. The medalists all under 14 seconds. Nia Richards of the Bahamas in fourth at 14.06, ahead of Abati of Martinique, Augustian of Grenada, and of course, Paul of Trinidad and Tobago did not start. Brilliant start to the afternoon.